Welcome to Moon Day by David Baresh. On a cold, black, starlit night, the lonely moon shone icy white. When all at once her phone purred in silent mode, of course. So she tapped the screen and listened. Her friend, the banana, spoke. Dearest moon, so high and alone, I will come and visit your home. Well, said the moon, do you have a rocket or a space elevator, perhaps? How can you fly so high into the starry midnight sky? Just you watch me, the banana said. And he started unfurling his yellow peel. Then he spun around and around. He turned as fast as he could go. Flipping and flapping, he twisted and twirled. And into the air, he dizzily swirled. Up and up and up he flew. He rose just like a bird. And soon he neared his friend the moon. Both smiled and said, hello. How can I land? The banana asked. It's okay, I know, said the moon. Three laser beams I will stream, and onto these you can rest. And three rays of light shot out into space, and there the banana touched down. And the two good friends, they chatted aloud. They laughed so much that they nearly cried. They couldn't sleep at all that night. They stayed awake until dawn's new light. I have an idea. Oh, the banana yawned. Let's take our photo together. And both smiled wide and the camera clicked and the date stamp read first day of the week. It's been so great, the banana said, still only half awake. Let's call today Moon Day. Wow, what a kind idea, said the moon. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And in a land called Japan, Monday became known as Moon Day. This is Moon Day, written by David Baresh. It is a memory aid. For more stories to help aid memory, go to Amazon.com and enter Every Picture Tells by David Baresh. Thank you for listening.